This motor is a My1020 1200 watt factory wound motor. Um, it should be able to handle about 48 volts and I think it's 26 or 27 amps per the uh, specs from the factory. Uh, right now I have the controller tuned back to 20 amp current limiting. When the project's done the motor uh, will be completely uh, rewound in terms of the armature will have heavier copper put onto it. The brush plate will be uh, upgraded substantially and the motor should be slotted and have uh, active cooling added to it. Uh, with that, with those new parameters I should be able to push 48 volts 75 amps peak which is uh, pretty much the limit of the controller at this point. That's going to give uh, the bike roughly the same performance as uh, a 50 cc gas engine three and a half to four horsepower maybe four and a half horsepower tops. The motor has a 10 tooth sprocket driving a 38 tooth bicycle sprocket that's been mounted onto what's left of the clutch basket. The clutch basket originally faced the other way. It's since been pulled out, cut back, uh, had holes drilled to uh, accommodate this socket here and it's just a standard bicycle chain. There's going to have to be some kind of a chain tensioner added to this as well. The power is coming off of four 17 amp hour Portalac 12 volt batteries that are wired batteries in series. Are connecting to a uh, Picox version 1.02C custom controller, uh, build details, schematics, uh, firmware for the microcontroller are all available off the workshop.ca. Just uh, look under energy Picox and it should all be there. This controller has been tested for 48 volt 75 amps peak. This display shows the data coming out of the Picox controller. Uh, starting at the left are, is the uh, digital throttle response. It's showing the actual numeric value of the throttle position. The center column is showing the current being drawn by the motor from the controller. Uh, just as a raw digital value coming off of uh, a Hall effect sensor built into the controller as well as on the right it's the actual current being drawn by the motor is uh, as in amperes. These are some of the parts that were pulled off the motor, the side casings, clutch basket, um, some other miscellaneous parts. That's first gear. So this is 6th gear, the top gear on this bike. 